can I tell you about the killing time? Am I hanging around waiting? Or is it time for me to take somebody out? You can't doubt it. It's gonna be like an amazing film. So, just saying. And that's a, that's a good thing when it picks your interest right off the bat. One of the things about The Killing Time that I find very unique is that, yes, it's got action. It has everything you would need in a film of its type. But it's really character driven, and that's unusual. First, I was kind of like, okay, so it's, it's mafia movie. And he was like, no, no, no. It is so much more than a mafia movie. And I was like, okay. When Steven sent me the script, the first thing I found interesting was the title, Killing Time. It's a double entendre. The characters are really deep and expressive. And it's about a mother and a daughter and a mom's quest to give her daughter a better life. And he's a second generation assassin for uh, organized crime. But at this point in my life, I feel like I'm in search of redemption. And I threw in a bounty hunter in there just for fun. When I first read the script, I thought it was really, the movie was really interesting because it's action packed, it's completely action packed. Like what's gonna happen next? <laughs> you don't know. This is my second film working with Steve and I think one of his strongest suits is developing the relationships between the characters. I liked the character Katie and I thought she was really interesting because she's scared but yet really brave to run off with her mom. It's so beautiful the relationship that Jessica and Katie have as mother and daughter. You've got to have cool action and that was another thing that attracted me to Killing Time. It's gunplay and it always comes down to Who's the quickest to shoot? Casting for the killing time is, is quite interesting. And I'm really excited to be working with Michael Pare. And I think that it's gonna show a side of him that people aren't used to seeing. I mean, the man has been in more films than I can even list. I think that the killing time is gonna show a side of him that people are gonna go, wow. It's a fascinating character to, to be a, a contract killer. I've, uh, I've never played it before, so that was one of the big attractions. Once I had Michael Pere, I went after my big bad guy. I just spoke to Steven and he told me Marty Kovic come on board. And I worked with Marty once on a, another small movie and he's a great guy. And getting the opportunity to work with Marty Kovic again is just going to be amazing. And it's going to be so great to see Marty and Michael go head to head with Diana and Tina, you know, in the middle of their war. It's just going to be great. You know, we're going to be shooting this in upstate New York in the Hudson Valley. It should be a beautifully photographed picture. Most of my childhood is in the Catskills, in Prattsville, Hunter, Wyndham, all the surrounding towns. They got devastated by Hurricane Irene and Hurricane Sandy didn't help them too much more either. There is a great need up in the Catskill region to bring in revenue, film production, art, museums, construction. And with film production is an area that I can help. The climax of the film hopefully will, if you donate, take place on the top of one of the beautiful skiing mountains in the Catskills. Why donate to The Killing Time is because we'll actually deliver an action-packed film but with an actual story. Crowdsourcing benefits the independent filmmaker because it's very hard to get financing for a neat little movie. People should donate to The Killing Time because it really is the movie that you want to see. It has the heart and character and relationships of a real indie film with the action scenes and the guns and the helicopters. We're gonna bring the most amazing film to you in the whole entire world. Small action movies will always make money if they have the cast and they do the action. Pretty much guaranteed. The Catskills need this, they want this, and you can make it happen for them and for you. If you donate, you will give them the help they need and you will get a great film out of it. We recognize that most people don't have $50,000 sitting in their back pocket. I mean, if you do, totally give it to us. Donate as much money as you possibly can. You could also um, share this. You could share it on Twitter, on Facebook. What you invested in, what you donated to, we'll see the light of day. It gives them access to all of the secret behind uh, the scenes of how a movie is made. And I want nothing more than to see this film sh just shoot for the moon. You know, I want it to be in a theater near you. Just share, 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 and we will be able to make this film all for you guys. Oh, <laughs> my